Hi friends, uh, so in this new video I will show you the manner used to plot a file the distribution, uh, surface distribution or each file surface distribution or G current uh, surface distribution. So in this new example I will work in Orion tenor of two elements, rectangular elements, okay, so here we have all right, antenna we have substrate and the ground run and two radiating elements. So, to plot the G surface the distribution current, so for example, we need to select a surface. So, we have, uh, we need to, to select faces here, okay, before uh, plotting uh, current distribution, okay, select faces. Now, we need to plot surface current distribution in radiating elements, so we select uh, surface of radiating elements. If we need to, to plot uh, surface distribution in all surface, surface surface, I include radiating elements, so we need to select the radiating element and the control, and we select the surface of our substrate okay like this so here we select the, cur the, the the radiating element surface and the surface of our substrate okay so now click right and we choose plot files plot files okay so here we have the G current distribution okay and we have each file distribution or a file distribution. So we we take the first case G current distribution. So magnitude G surface, okay, like this. So here we have magnitude G surface, vector H, and a lot of parameters. So we 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 take magnitude G surface. So all objects, okay. So here we have frequency and phase. We can show with phase. Okay, other fast, and we can here uh, look that we have just one single frequency. Okay, so to, ch to, to change frequency, we need to go to solution setup and we, sh we, uh, we choose sweep. Okay, sweep. So if we choose sweep, we can find here the mark the interval of our frequencies. Okay, but for us, we can just select. The resonance frequency of our array antenna, so we choose setup last adaptive, okay. And we have here our resonance frequency of our array antenna, okay. So we select monitor G surface, all objects, and we select down, okay. Now we can observe that we have the G surface current. Unity here is ampere per meter. Okay, so we can look that we have G surface distribution currents. Okay, so we can change unity here. So we go to we go directly to G surface. Okay, click right on G surface and modify attributes. Okay, so we go to square. Okay, here square. So if we work with auto, so we have unity here and per, per meter. If we choose decibel, we can we can look that the, the parameter here unity change in decibel G surface. Okay, so we can observe that our parameters current is in decibel. Okay, so we can go to linear or logarithmic uh, unity. Okay, linear or logarithmic. Oh, here we have logarithmic square, and here we have linear square. Okay, so what do you need? You can show the unity that you need. So here, if we choose auto without decibel, we have a lot of unities. For example, micro ampere per meter, or milli ampere per meter, or ampere per meter, or kilo ampere per meter. Okay. So the international unit is ampere per meter. Okay. 
سوهان جاست فور فور كيرنت ديستريبيشن هي سيرفاس كيرنت ديستريبيشن is the same for if we need to to plot a file or each file is the, the same manner okay so I will delete this he surface current okay and I will select a new uh, the, the surface for example in this case I choose just radiating elements okay so select faces okay and I go to radiating element like this so here I select just radiating elements okay without subtract and I will uh, plot a file distribution in this radiating element okay a file go to a file the magnitude of file like this so I can choose magnitude of file all objects okay so here like the first example I can change frequency uh, by choosing sweep okay so I can change another fr frequency for plotting I can change phases okay but for our example I choose just our resonance frequency it's 7 pound 38 gigahertz okay so down so we can observe that the surface uh, the surface of file distribution in both parameter uh, for radiating elements just for radiating elements okay so the, the same example, I can go to a file here, I change unity, modify three base, I go to score, I, ch I choose decibel, okay, I can look, I can say that the parameters unity change to our decibel, a file in decibel, okay, if I, I work without decibel, linear score, for example here, or logarithmic score, and I can charge unity to voyant per centimeter. Okay, so you can you can follow the same manner to file to file each file any parameters you need. Firstly, to select the surface of our uh, radiating elements or substrates or all objects, and I can after choose uh, plot files and I choose the parameter that. Uh, interest us okay and we have other parameters here for example temperature okay surface force density okay voluminous density average is or air okay so we have a lot of parameters that's all what do you need to plot you need firstly to select the surface of our uh, element okay I go to select spaces okay and I choose the face that interests us and I go to plot files and I show the parameter that interests us. Okay, so, so this is the manner used to plot file uh, surface uh, files for current or a file or H file. Okay, see you in other videos.